It's gonna be me sorting my life out. Yek Shemesh! Molly, what's up, dude? You can't buy a TV, but you can get steam in for two weeks. Fantastic. Honestly, my nipples could cut glass right now. Good morning. Welcome back to the channel. It's not the morning. It's like half past 12, quarter to one. I'm being super lazy today. We're on lockdown, so I'm allowed. I did a poll on my Instagram and I asked you guys, do you want to see what a day in the life looks like for me during lockdown? Like England, Austria, Germany, I think France are going into lockdown. So I thought I would do a day in the life just to show you what I kind of get up to. Maybe it'll just give you some sort of ideas or just solve like five minutes of boredom. I I have picked a day where I've got quite a few things to do, but don't expect anything crazy. Like it's not, we can't do much. I can't really meet up with anybody. It's gonna be me sorting my life out or attempting to, that it, it's probably not gonna happen. So <laughs> I'm gonna do a workout because that is the best way to start your day. I know it might seem like I'm self-conscious about this, but I'm I'm just, I'm not self-conscious about the headband. You know, I don't have to explain it every time I wear it. I just, it keeps your hair out of your face and, yeah, it looks ridiculous. One thing I haven't done in this entire time I've had a YouTube channel is introduce you to Marley. What's up, dude? Yeah, we don't actually talk to each other. We have this understanding where basically he shuts up if I'm like watching TV or doing work. And in exchange, if I have a Subway or like a McDonald's, I'll give him a cup so he can chew and rip to shreds. And they're right. Yeah. I'm not gonna go near him. He's not actually mine, he's my grandfather's. And if I go near him, he'll probably take my finger off, so. It's it's like a love-hate relationship, but it works. I know I've been harping on about Joe Wicks for the past couple of videos, but genuinely, if you're in lockdown, it makes you feel a lot better. It's freezing cold, but I'm gonna do mine outside just because it's a bigger achievement then. Many hours later. <sighs> Worth it. <sighs> okay, time for a mid-afternoon-ish snack. So I think I'm gonna have this bowl of cereal, have a quick shower, maybe pop out and grab an extra snack because this bowl of cereal ain't gonna do much. You know, I'm a growing boy. I'm trying to grow. <laughs> trying for the last 10 years. I'm joking, we're not sad about that. It's just kind of finding things to kill time with. All right, I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> I've not done anything since I showered. Like, I haven't even done my hair. I don't know, I just felt a little bit unmotivated, I guess. I know that was not supposed to happen. After working out, I was supposed to be like, yeah, let's do shit, and, but uh, I just be faking the energy and that's not real. So I kind of just feel like I'm a little tired of the routine of life at the moment being, you wake up, you go to work, you come home, you go to sleep. You wake up, you it's the same thing. Like at the moment, it just feels like it's about 90% work and 10% living. And that's not really fun. And I'm glad that I've kind of hit this point today because if I had this like, yeah, everything's great. I'm dealing with lockdown fantastically. It wouldn't have been a true representation of what I felt like through the summer. This isn't as bad as what I was in the summer, by the way. I was way worse in the summer. I would rather just be honest about it because I think that's what people need to be doing, especially men need to start talking about things like that. If it helps just one person, then that's why I'm putting it in this video because that's all that really matters then is you're using your platform to help somebody and not just entertain somebody. Also, if you're wondering why I took so long to post after my life update video, it's because I actually had a load of like campaigns and things come through and I was working with loads of different companies doing stuff like Yek Shemesh! I do this at like obviously quarter to midnight. It's currently 10 degrees, so maximum shrinkage is happening right now. I did ask them though, just for the maskini, I didn't really need the nude bodysuit, but they did say it's for TikTok, and well, TikTok is still a kid's app, despite having questionably aged people twerking and reenacting sex moves to popular songs. Uh, this would not have been allowed. Shockingly. That's a whole road we just don't need to go into. I just want to show you this. <laughs> I'm not showing you anything else. You have to go to my TikTok to watch the rest. If you ask me, do you regret leaving your old job now? Well, 
<laughs> Absolutely fucking not. Yeah, it was, uh, I just took a couple of weeks. I might just do a little bit of spring cleaning right now in autumn. This is my little office. Obviously, that's my desk where it used to be there, so I moved it over there. I know it doesn't look tidy, but it is tidy. So I got some things to eBay. I used to be a huge WWE fan. <laughs> I also need to sort the postage out for the Asta piece as well and sort the giveaway out, because I did say I would do that last week, but I just haven't got around to doing it yet. Now I am off to the supermarket. There was a lot of backlash on the first day of lockdown because supermarkets and shops in Wales were not allowed to sell non-essential items and people just went crazy myself included because it was stupid like how dare somebody decide what's essential and what's not essential i actually have footage from the first night of lockdown when i snuck out to go and check out the carnage at the supermarkets so upstairs where all the clothing is is closed off electrical items and homeware is all over there as well so if your kettle breaks or your tv breaks or your microwave breaks tough shit will you have all the cards and things like that that's all closed off as well. So you can get to the pharmacy area. And of course, naturally, alcohol is essential. So you can't buy a TV, but you can get steam in for two weeks. Fantastic. Yeah, so... so <coughs> Oh, Corona. I'm joking, I haven't got COVID. Um, that I know of. I'm joking, but I don't know. I'm not being tested. I know that whole segment breaks the whole a day in the life rules, but get, I'm gonna do what I want. And it's like four degrees out. This is, this is the coldest night so far. Honestly, my nipples could cut glass right now. Yeah, so as you can see, lots has changed here. This was actually all blocked off the other day. Good to see you're able to buy simple things. Anything that is still blocked off is upstairs where clothes and electrical are, oh, so. Always treat yourself. Twice. Shopping is done, so back home, let's have some food. Just had food, I'm gonna chill now. I'm actually gonna watch my main man Borat, being as this uh, kind of relevant to this video. But thank you guys for watching. I hope I gave you a break for like, eight minutes. Eight minutes, that's how long you talk shit for. Thanks, future Carl, appreciate that. You're welcome. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and of course, subscribe with the notifications turned on, because some really exciting stuff coming towards you. <sighs> Be ready. Be ready. That sounds like that guy on TikTok, and it? it's like a time traveler. On this day, be ready. I'm not a time traveler. I don't think. Uh, yeah, bye. <laughs> TikTok done, baby!